Alexis here. That's me. I am the crafter behind Persialoo.com. And today we are going to be talking about all of the many things that you can make with your silhouette cameo. This guy right here. So I've just kind of spread some things around the table here. These are all projects that I've made with my silhouette. And we're going to be talking about how many different things you can make with your machine in this video. I am teaming up with my girl Colleen over at Lemon Thistle for this video. This is part of our Silhouette versus Cricut Challenge series. So she's going to be talking about all of the things that you can make with your Cricut over on her video, which I will link to below. And even if you are only a Silhouette user, you might want to check out her video because the Cricut and Silhouette have a lot of similar abilities, capabilities. So I know she's going to have some great inspiration for you over there too. If you are new to Silhouette, if you just got your cameo or if you're thinking about getting one, then this video is perfect for you because it will just give you lots of ideas, all the many ways that you can use this machine to make awesome projects, home decor, gifts, party decor, we're gonna talk about it. So many things, so many things. All right, so let's go see what you can make with your silhouette. First, we're gonna talk about t-shirts. I think t-shirts might be one of the most popular silhouette projects, and I know a lot of new silhouette users wanna learn how to make a t-shirt right away. It's really easy to cut designs out of heat transfer material or iron-on vinyl with your silhouette, and then iron those designs onto a t-shirt, onesie, sweatshirt, any top that you want. I've had so many people over the years ask me to help them make t-shirts for birthday parties, for holidays, for gifts, vacations, and I have made tons of t-shirts over the years for my kids, for vacations, for so many reasons. When it's so easy to whip up a t-shirt, why wouldn't you make one for every occasion? But silhouette heat transfer projects are not limited to t-shirts. You can make so many things. I love to use iron-on vinyl in my silhouette to make custom aprons, which make a great gift. You can also add your own designs to throw pillows, tote bags, and other kinds of clothing like shorts, jackets, leggings, even canvas shoes. All right, so we talked a little bit about what you can make using heat transfer vinyl in your silhouette. Now let's talk a little bit about adhesive vinyl decals. The silhouette cuts adhesive vinyl beautifully and you can use that to make decals or stickers basically to put on all kinds of surfaces. You can use these decals to decorate notebooks or you know, school supplies. Really you can apply a vinyl decal to any smooth hard surface which means you can apply vinyl decals to walls and other surfaces in your home. I've actually a couple times done full wall murals using vinyl decals in my home. One of my favorite ways to use vinyl decals is to personalize mugs or tumblers. Vinyl with a permanent adhesive hand washes well and works great for cups because of that. Because you can get adhesive vinyl in all kinds of colors, patterns, finishes, even color changing vinyl, you can create so many amazing decals with your silhouette machine. Next up, paper. There are so many great things you can make by cutting paper with your silhouette. Silhouette Portrait 3 and Cameo 4 can cut all kinds of paper from lightweight copy paper to cardstock all the way up to light chipboard. This makes the silhouette a great tool for cutting out paper shapes for scrapbooking, tags for gift giving, making cards and envelopes, You can also use it to make 3D paper crafts, like boxes, which is one of my very favorite things to make. I've made so many paper boxes over the years. You can also use it to make paper flowers by cutting different levels of petals and leaves out of paper and then shaping and gluing them together into paper flowers. To give you an idea of all the different kinds of 3D paper projects you can make with your silhouette, you can head over to the Silhouette Design Store and search 3D paper, and you'll see examples of the types of projects you can make, as well as find cut files to make those projects. Everything from paper flowers to paper holiday decorations, boxes, letters, so many projects that you can make using paper and your silhouette machine. Another thing that I love to make with my silhouette is stickers. We already talked about vinyl decals, which I think about differently because it's more shapes that you cut out of colored or patterned vinyl to create the design. Whereas with stickers, you're printing your design onto sticker paper or some kind of printable vinyl and then cutting around that design with your silhouette. The silhouette is an especially great tool for making stickers because compared to Cricut, it does have a larger print and cut area. 
You can make all kinds of different stickers using your Silhouette machine. I have made planner stickers, sticker sheets, sticker gift tags, and if you use printable vinyl, you can even make waterproof vinyl stickers that will hold up to all kinds of wear and tear. Another thing I love to use my Silhouette for is to make custom stencils. You can cut stencils out of adhesive vinyl, heat transfer vinyl, and the Silhouette stencil material. Then you can use those stencils with paint, with ink, even with spray dye, to easily add any design to any project you're working on. In addition to cutting, the Silhouette can also sketch or draw using the Silhouette sketch pens or any drawing tool that will fit in the pen holder. You can sketch with chalk, permanent markers, white opaque pens. I've even sketched with a glue pen and then added embossing powder on top of that to get a really cool embossed effect. You can also use the sketch feature with a third party tool like the foil quill, which allows you to add heat activated foiling to any project. I've used the Silhouette Sketch feature to make cards, tags, labels, to write on envelopes. You can also use the Sketch feature to help you create some fun art projects. You can sketch out a design using a permanent marker and then add watercolors over the top. You can also sketch out a design using a pencil to easily create a kind of watercolor coloring page. One of the things that Silhouette is really great at is personalization. It makes it super easy to label and monogram anything you want. And because you can use any image at all with your silhouette, it is so easy to turn your own handwriting, your child's handwriting or artwork into a physical item or a really special gift. Or make your favorite team's logo in your favorite color. There's so many possibilities. Next, let's talk a little bit about parties. Anytime there's a party happening at my house, you can be sure that my silhouette is working overtime. Just for a little example, a few years ago, I threw a unicorn party for my daughter and I used my silhouette to make t-shirts for the guests, unicorn paper lantern decorations, a cake topper, candy favors, and even a craft that the kids made at the party. So far, we've talked mostly about paper and vinyl projects. Let's talk a little bit about some other materials. Silhouette actually makes a lot of specialty media that you can cut with your machine. For example, I have cut shrink film several times with my Silhouette to make fun statement earrings. Silhouette also makes printable tattoo paper that you can use the print and cut feature to make really fun temporary tattoos. Another favorite specialty media is the scratch off sticker paper, which you can use to make your own totally custom scratch off cards. In addition to specialty media, with the Cameo 4's more powerful second tool carriage, you can also cut materials like fabric, felt, acetate, and other thicker or more dense materials. Okay, even though we have truly only scratched the surface of things you can make with your silhouette, I am going to wrap up this video here. I hope that you've enjoyed this video and that it's given you some new ideas for ways that you can use your silhouette. Until next time, happy making. Bye!